We'll be telling you about the Anti-Corruption Commission, ACC, arresting former Zambia Army Chief of Operations and an officer in the Office of the President, Special Division for Corruption involving exportation of uh, Mukula logs without following laid down procedure. Well, ACC uh, spokesperson uh, Queen Chibwe says Brigadier General Gilbert Mulenga, that's his name, has been charged with uh, one. All right, let's take you now to Ghana, where authority of office. Mrs. Chibwe says whilst acting together with persons unknown on dates unknown but between the 1st of June 2021 and 30th of September 2021 in Lusaka, General Mulenga did abuse the authority of office. She says was done by arbitrarily resolving to regularize an attempted illegal export to China of 23 containers laden with Mukula logs transported by Ascon Tembo of Ak General Suppliers. Mm. Well, the ACC's uh, spokesperson says the act is actually prejudicial uh, to the uh, uh, interest of the government of Zambia. And Mrs. Chibwe says Bruce Angola, uh, an executive officer at of the office of the president's uh, special division, has also been arrested and charged with the same offence of abuse of authority of office. Now, let's take you back to the story in Zambia where the Anti-Corruption Commission, as the ACC, has come out to make a statement. We have our correspondent from Zambia, Lydia Makina, to give us more on this. Good morning, Lydia. Now, we know that the AACC has arrested many, but no convictions yet. I mean, could you tell us the reason for such? Well, there could be that, uh, you know, the, the arrests that have been happening, actually, that's uh, the question for each and everyone here, because uh, we have seen a lot of arrests. Uh, people are being called for investigation, but uh, and they haven't yet been taken to court. And, uh, uh, and the Constitution of Zambia is just, you know it, just that it allows people to get on bail and then they, they can actually uh, go home and they wait until they're being called for court. But the reason for this uh, is that because uh, the, the Anti-Corruption Commission are doing investigation until they find a solid, uh, you know, uh, evidence to that person for him to be taken to court or for her to be taken to court. So this is what they are working uh, at. And uh, we see that the arrest that, that has been taken place so far, they are still investigating. A lot are being caught, and uh, yet uh, others are still, you know, others who appear in court, those that who, you know, those that who find they, they had uh, evidence with, uh, but those that will not have any uh, solid evidence, they will not even go to court. So the reason for that is because uh, the Anti-Corruption Commission is to investigating on their matters until they find a solid evidence to say, okay, this is what you did, and then they can be able to take that person to court. All right, Lydia. So um, let me quickly ask you this question. Tell us about um, uh, uh, this particular uh, former um, uh, former Zambia Army Chief. I'm talking about uh, the one uh, known as uh, uh, Gilbert uh, Mulenga. Tell us a little bit about him, what you know about him. More importantly, also tell us um, uh, what are the laid down procedures uh, in order for you to export um, Mokula logs? Well, for this, uh, actually, uh, he's not the first person that has been uh, called for investigation on this matter. Uh, the Mokula log has been going on uh, since the last year. And uh, him being in government, uh, he, he was uh, in, or, or let me say, he was working in government previously with the previous uh, government, and they were the one that were dealing with this uh, Mukula uh, lot. And uh, to see that the Anti-Corruption Commission co are calling on those that we are dealing, those that were in government, and uh, to hear to say that since uh, some truck were being transferred to, you know, uh, without, the, uh, uh, without the permission from the headquarters, and also saw that uh, 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 the Chinese had sent money uh, you know, in other uh, in in people's accounts. Let me let me not mention names on that. But they had sent money in some uh, some of the officials, government officials' accounts, without the nation knowing what what was going on with that uh, transaction. And then the uh, the, uh, the former brigadier general, he has been called on that because of the same truck that were being uh, transferred, that were being sent to you know to China. And concerning the Mkola, you know, the Mkola tree that were uh, being taken there. So this is the matter that has been, but he's not the first one that has been called for this matter. A lot have been called on this because of the, the, the previous regime that they were in, as well as to say that there are a lot of people who are being involved. And the Anti-Corruption Commission is just calling upon 
each and every suspect, they uh, seem to say, you were behind this and they are calling upon that. So with him, because he worked with that and that's why he has been caught on that uh, case. All right. All right, Lydia. So I would say that this is in no form a case of witch hunting, especially if you look at uh, uh, a governmental approach towards uh, ensuring that he faces conviction. Yes. And then, uh, you know, uh, what is happening right now with uh, the current situation is that uh, uh, His Excellency, uh, His Excellency Chilema, had said to say, actually, the previous regime had, uh, you know, they spread a uh, rumor that was going on to say it was full of corruption. And this is what the anti-corruption the anti -corruption commission is attacking the previous government with that because they were behind each and every act. They are claiming to be behind on that.